Good morning. <clears throat> Hopefully I'm talking loud enough. Um, so it is Sunday, May 8th, Mother's Day. Um, it's about 8.30. I just ordered some groceries because we have no food in the house because I have not been doing my regular orders because I've been working. I got like maybe three or four hours of sleep last night. Zoe was screaming for who knows how long. Really don't know why she's not sick. I don't think she's teething, so I don't know. But she was screaming, crying. Then when I got her to calm down, her sister started crying. And then they both woke up running their mouths at like 8, 7, 30, 8 o'clock. I have to work today. One of my girls that I just promoted a month ago to from a sales associate to a sales lead, which is basically a key holder, decided to quit, told me yesterday, and gave me a two-day notice. I'm also on vacation next week, so she basically quit the week that I'm on vacation, staycation, um, with no regard for how the store was going to be run with me not in the building and her leaving. <laughs> so she's dead to me. My stomach hurts because, surprise. I am pregnant. <laughs> I'm about 11 and a half weeks pregnant. So, yeah. Welcome to this vlog. My appointment is definitely like right now. And I'm just now walking up to this place. So hopefully, they will hurry up. Look at me rushing them. I'm late. <laughs> and I'm rushing them. But yeah. Definitely running late. Or right on time, which is late. Leave a sample. I'm in here waiting for the doctor. I'm sure I'm not supposed to be showing all this stuff, but um I was hearing like this like sound. It sounded like a baby's heartbeat on the um <sighs> ultrasound. But that joint is strong, like brolic. That's a healthy baby. But then I realized, because then it had like a rhythm to it, which all heartbeats do have a rhythm, but it didn't sound like a normal heartbeat rhythm. So I was like, I don't think that's the baby's heartbeat that I'm hearing. I think I'm just hearing sounds. Child, I don't know. I'm never getting pregnant again. Today was such a rough day. I didn't vlog anything. I made one little video of Zoe eating. I've been nauseous since last night. Um, like, really nauseous last night. And then it kind of went away. This morning, this one piece won't tuck. Um, kind of went away this morning. And I was able to just, like, get my day started. But then it, like, crept back in. And my stomach was just, like, crampy. And I just felt weird all day. And so tired. So I have, like, one more day that I can just chill, which is tomorrow. And get some housework done. Because then Thursday I have my hair appointment. And then Friday is our play date. And then my best friend flies in that night. And then the weekend is just pretty stacked so i'm gonna just chill as much as possible tomorrow and tonight so i'm gonna go ahead and peace out and i will talk to you guys tomorrow good morning it is so early well it's early for me i'm usually up but not out at this point <laughs> i'm on my way to my hair appointment it is in Kennesaw, going to see my girl, Stacy, who I've been going to for years. She finally has her own salon suite. Um, and so 
that is where I'm headed for the first time. I booked this appointment back in February when I had to cancel an appointment because of staffing issues at work. And this was the earliest, the next availability that she had for what I needed was May. So, you know I'm getting up and going to this point. back at home with my girls. <laughs> hey. Child, it's so quiet in here because the Wi-Fi is out. And so, um, tell them, Zara. Uh-uh, Zara, don't put your hands in my hair. Um, we can't watch our shows. We could play music, but ain't no speaker because our speakers are the Google Home over there. Um, because it's 2022 and everything is hooked up to Wi-Fi. I'm going to see if I can get my phone to stream from YouTube onto the Fire Stick phone. What's up, girl? I don't know if my phone is even going to pick up the um, stream. I mean, if the fire stick is even going to pick up like the signal from my phone because it's all literally done through Wi-Fi. I think it's like three o'clock and we still have about a good five hours to go before bedtime. So we usually watch like Sing Along, Sesame Street, Dora the Explorer, things like that. And we ain't got that right now. Let me see what I can make happen up in here. Because it is just, it's too quiet. Like, I know the girls don't feel either way. But it's just really, really quiet in here. And I would at least like um, some sing-alongs in the background or YouTube, something. My husband says because it's because I'm from New York, I need like background noise. I've always been like that. Especially when I live by myself. Like, I have the TV on and don't even be watching it. Um, I'll have YouTube on when I'm like doing my makeup. I will have, um, stop it. I'll have, of course, music playing. So I've just always been that person who needed like background noise. So I need something going on in the background. Is just, yeah, it says home is currently unavailable. But let me see if I can get it to stream from my phone because my phone doesn't have to be hooked up to Wi Fi for its play. So, oh, pasta for me, yum, yum, yum. So, we're waiting. I got it to find my phone. Um, I put on my personal hotspot. Ooh. It's the hair and the food from the food and the hair for me. Anyway, I got it to find to link to. Ooh, yum 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 yum. Thank you. Oh, more. Okay. Yum, 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 yum. Thank you. Hi, <laughs> Sue. But now it's just like sitting here. No stink. She doesn't want the pasta. Is she Jewish? It looks like a yarmulke. Okay. I mean, they're clearly unbothered. Um, I think the silence is more so bothering me. They're clearly like, whatevs. What happened? You lost your spaghetti? Mommy will get your spaghetti for you, okay? I don't know. 
know you got any solutions? The other one is the one that works, thing. That one, yeah. And now I'm getting a phone call. Uh oh, is the knot turned on? Oh, somebody turned it off. Let's turn this back on. There you go. Oh, and here's just spaghetti. Here, yeah, baby. Yeah. All right, well, we're back to square one because now I can't find the phone, which means my hotspot probably cut off, so. And the walker just randomly started playing music. Okay, let me figure this out. So that was an epic fail because it's saying no internet. So I guess in order for your hotspot to work, oh wait, ooh, it just connected. Like literally just connected. Okay, let's see if it'll let me. I know. Praise dance. Yay. Okay, so let's see if it'll let me stream YouTube. It literally just connected. Okay. Success. We got it to work. So I got it to hook up to my phone's hotspot. And I can't stream from my phone, but we got the fire stick to work. So at least we have something. Now, I don't know how hotspots work exactly. So I don't know how long we're going to be able to do this. I don't know what's about to happen. But what I do know is it's working right now. And my child wants a snack. So we're going to watch Aaliyah, who the girls love, and eat some snacks. Yeah. Um, the day is pretty much over for me, at least. The girls are down. My husband is in the bathroom singing in the shower. Don't know if y'all can hear that or not. Um, but apparently it's a Chris Brown kind of night. I did manage to change my sheets. Bam. I did not fold the girls' clothes, but I did vacuum the whole house. So that's done. Nail appointment is at 10. Hopefully I can get some sleep tonight. This insomnia has been just as annoying as the need for food every two hours and the indigestion and all those things so i'm gonna say good night and i will talk to y'all tomorrow good morning it is friday may 13th oh it's friday the 13th um i'm on my way to the nail salon i'm running late maybe like five minutes late um i said i was gonna have a full beat i do not but i did take my hair down so that i can look cute er at the nail salon so at least my hair is not up in the bonnet uh, my nanny is watching them right now while i go get my nails done and then i gotta run to the grocery store real quick um and then i've decided for today what we're gonna do is um i'm gonna let them nap at the house like they always do so that it's not interrupting with their normal flow and then as long as it's not raining i'll head to my friend's house for the play date and then we'll just kick it out there by the time we get to her house it'll be like 4 4 30 and my best friend should be landing around 8 so that's not too long it's just a couple hours outside um or at somebody else's house rather um so yeah I'll let the girls play for a couple hours feed them dinner there put them in their little onesie pajamas um and like some little sweatpants and then we will head to the airport pick up my best friend and they'll probably sleep on the way back to the house so yeah that is the plan um i'm leaving room for the plan to not go as planned because that is life and that is especially life with kids it is unpredictable at times so right on time so now we're in Publix I just needed to grab some diapers um, I always get a salad for my husband when I'm here because he loves we love public salads and um, I've been wanting some noodles but like the ramen noodles let me get me a pack 
because I've literally, I think I told you I've been craving like salt. And um, that's gotta be one of the saltiest things on the planet. And I'm here for it. If I could just find it, then I'm gonna go to McDonald's and get me a double cheeseburger and fries. I think all the pandemic babies are like the same size because they never have Huggies Baby Dry size six. It's only size five. Do they not make size six? Like Zoe wears a six. She thick. And they never have anything in a size six. They also wear the cruisers, even though we do cruisers 360 because it has that stretchy van. We do that throughout the day. And then they sleep in the Pampers Baby Drive, but they, they don't have that either. They have the big Pampers Baby Drive, but I don't need that many because it's just for nighttime. I swear, like this will work for Zara. But what about my good sister Zoe? Look who's here, y'all. The for best friend. The only one. The only the BFF only. That's on that we acknowledge. Okay. okay. Thank you. A1 since day one. Day one. <laughs> cover your boot. Cover. No, ma'am. <laughs> absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> Giving the people a show. Okay, but stop. We finally arrived at our. Not yelling at me like I'm one of the kids. Anyway, we have finally arrived at our second destination, which is brunch. We're gonna go to Sugar Factory Atlanta. We were gonna go to South City Kitchen, but it was it was given like two. It's given vacation, but it's given. First of all, I'm not even talking about you. Oh, okay, because right. you were though. I wasn't. But you I were. actually wasn't. But you were. I really, you, you were really wasn't. Prior though. To you I said you we finally about. arrived at our destination. Okay, I apologize. Right. So when I play this back, okay. and you were yelling at me for no reason, okay. I'm gonna need an apology. I just apologize in the just comment now. section. <laughs> Thank you. Anyway, we were gonna go to South City Kitchen, but it was like it was giving just bougie food, and we just want food. Yeah, we want to eat, eat. Right. We want like just brunch, food. just like regular brunch options. Yeah. So, um, Sugar Factory popped up. So, mm -hmm. we're gonna, I haven't been here in a, in a long time. And I've never been. Okay. Mm -hmm. I've been to the one in Miami, which is always good. Let's cross here, please. Okay. Um, the one in Miami is always good. Never been to this one for brunch. So, we're gonna see how this turns out. Can you I think it's. Uh, that, I'm just saying. That's what I said. Okay. Is that what we're doing now? That's literally what I said. Okay. I said, let's get on the sidewalk. Oh, oh, I thought you were trying to go back to last night. But okay. What? I didn't know. You know, with the whole sidewalk thing you did. Go ahead. Just because you don't know how to navigate an airport. That's fine. That's fine. I'm not a native up here. <laughs> but an airport is an airport. Anyway, you told me to get in the middle. I couldn't see the middle. All right. Anyway, it's a very beautiful day outside. Um... D went and got her toes done. I did, and enjoyed it thoroughly. Yeah, oh good, I'm glad, okay. So now we're gonna, donut smuggler. So now we're gonna go eat, and then probably go to the mall afterwards. But not the ghetto mall. Not the ghetto mall. Yeah, no. AKA Lennox. <laughs> <laughs> we're thinking perimeter. But we're also just kind of like freestyling it. We're going with the vibes. So right. we're going to see just where the day takes us. So. And then we're going to go back home and see the babies. And then we're going to go back home and see the babies and watch Real Housewives of Atlanta. Because we have some catching up to do. So yeah, that's pretty much the whole day. Mm -hmm. No, it's okay. Oh my god. I know. We in here eating. We are done. And no, drinking. We are done eating. No, don't say we're eating. We're tired. <laughs> we're low key cooked. Like, yeah. we're tired. Like, we are old. We are old. We ain't got our nails done. We're to the gas station. To get snacks. We're done. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. It is the food. <laughs> oh, 
child, I just dropped a piece of waffle and the waffle is good. It's nice and fluffy and buttery. We're tired. Is it because we have kids? Because we're in our 30s? Well, both. We would have way more energy yeah. if we didn't have kids. Right. Like, and let me tell y'all, this is so good, but like, I'm already like, I told Nikki, I felt like a wind <laughs> and pushed me over just now. So I'm gonna chill out. Like, we're gonna go to the mall for like a good hour. Probably 15 minutes. 15 minutes. We're gonna go to Sephora. We're gonna look for a bra for Diana. Um, and I think that's really gonna be it. Like, we're ready to go back to the house. Oh, oh. <laughs> like, we don't have nothing to do today, but we just wanna go home. home. The girls who know, the girls, girls who, who get, get, it, get it, get it. <laughs> My nails. Where do be... I put it in that? Wait. Here? No. This Where? Way. Here? Yeah. And pull it out? Credit okay, card yes. okay. okay, come on. Does it give you a receipt though? Girl, I don't give out no receipt. Okay. Meet me at the at the front. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> So, happy Sunday. It's um, May 15th, I think. Sunday, May 15th. It's a little after 12. It's 12.01. Best friend is still here. Still here. She leaves today, though. Mm -hmm. um, this is a terrible angle, but it's fine. We have done nothing. Not a thing. And I loved it. Yeah, it was great. Like, <laughs> we came back to the house. We ate. We played with the babies. We watched Real Housewives mm -hmm. all day. Mm -hmm. And that was pretty much it. So now we're about to cook. We're doing a little soul food Sunday. Yes, ma'am. We're going to do chicken, mac and cheese, yams, collard greens, and cornbread. Yep. Yeah. And then we're going to put the babies down for a nap. Mm -hmm. And then head to the airport. Mm-hmm. And that's pretty much it. That's it. And yeah, we're going to try to chill a little bit more. <laughs> I mean, chill more. That's all we've been doing. Right, if we can, we're going to chill a little bit more. And that's that's literally it. Yeah. So we about to cook. That's pretty much it. Yeah. We've been, it. we've been laying. But no, because it, I've been tired. Like, not saying that we've been moving too much. But it's just, I told Mark, it was the sun. <laughs> <laughs> not the sun and it was only 83 degrees it was right it wasn't even that hot it wasn't that hot it was actually very nice and like part it was cloudy. but sis let me tell you something tell i don't know something. something about that atl sun hit different from south carolina because i was baking like a chicken <laughs> in the oven but i wasn't sweating though but now you got cute yeah i was cooking cute though yeah. like i had a little bit of bronze on me but <laughs> I was so tired was when I came back food. here. Yeah, and that food too, like it was so heavy. Yeah, like it really. Was a lot of food, mm -hmm. and it was just heavy. It, it was. It was really like, but what, what was it? Candy fact? Sugar factory. Sugar factory. I don't know why I keep calling it the candy factory. Yeah, they had candy everywhere. It was. It was really, really a lot of food. Like I literally just finished the rest of it right. fifteen minutes ago. Right. Which it was still really good, but yep. Definitely, if ever you like are dealing with sleep issues, you <laughs> can't get to sleep, you want to get like good night's sleep, go over to the sugar factory, sugar get you factory. some um chicken and waffles. Yeah, I wouldn't advise you, you to get that um that big old drink by yourself, but that chicken yeah. and waffles will put you right to sleep. All right, y'all, I'm about to go cook anyway. Peace out. <laughs>